Hello and welcome to FCE 365 TV. My name is Joe Snow and today at Technology at its finest I present you how to restore a jailbroken iPhone or iDevice without losing the jailbreak. It's very important for you to uh, be able to restore with uh, a program and not to lose the jailbreak because sometimes the uh, latest version that is being installed while iTunes restores uh, the, the normal phone will keep you from having the jailbreak again. So if you have jailbreak on your phone and the phone is listed into this, uh, this thing, so um, between iOS 5.0 and 8.4, you are able to do a semi-restore with this application you see here. Uh, it's application, it's available for Windows, OS 6 and Linux. It's created by, let me check it out, um, by Coolstar and with multiple uh, persons for both 2G, Evaders, we, we now I Hate Snow and the Tango team and whatever. Well, they helped. And it's very great, it's a great application. Um, so let's test it. What's the point of it? As I said, if you have the latest uh, version, then there is no point for you to use it because for you there is no jailbreak but for example for 9.1 for iOS 9.1 there is no jailbreak but for iOS 8.4 which is the latest version supported by our application you can have jailbreak but if you do restore your iPhone you lose the jailbreak and you will be uh, updated to iOS 9.1 which is not jailbreakable for the moment so how you restore and keep the, um, the iPhone from losing jailbreak. You go to Semi Restore 8, the program we've downloaded, it's uh, available in, a, in, um, in the description of this uh, video. And first of all, you downgrade your iTunes. If you have your iTunes on the version 12.2 or 12.x, then you have to downgrade it to iTunes 11.4. The link is in the description for both 64 and 32 gigabit bits. Sorry. Okay. Uh, the application requires you to install from Cydia the OpenSHSH. After you open Cydia, you go to search and write OpenSHSH. Install that thing, and after that, you come back to the application. I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna show you how to use it. Okay. The application starts in less than a minute, as you can see here, and the semi restore works as I said for iOS 5.0 to iOS 8.4. It detected my iPhone 4, which is on iOS 7.1.2 between those two, and it's jaw broken because my iPhone 5 is not jaw broken for the moment, but even if it would be, then uh, the iOS 9.0.2 which is the latest uh, jailbreakable version for um, iPhone 5 it's is not supported by the application after you you open it you connect your device without any passcode on it and you click semi restore it will connect it via SHSH this is why you have to have open SHSH okay my phone uh, has respringed and it's cleaning up do not touch your device yet Okay, uh, keep in mind that um, everything will be lost. Um, I mean, your data will be lost, but this is the point of, of a restore, to erase everything, but, or jailbreak. Okay, so um, my phone now shows the uh, Apple logo with the progress bar that is increasing. Even if the program shows semi-restore complete, my phone is, um, it's almost increasing. Yeah, 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 it started to increase. It increased very fast. Okay, but the phone didn't start it yet. So you have to wait pacefully. Okay, my phone shows the Apple logo now. Okay. Still, okay, it seems that um, it works through the... Um, the charger it detected my charger okay 
and it's on the hello screen right now okay let me uh, configure it I'm gonna have iTunes oh shit I have to reinstall iTunes okay uh, please donate oh yeah if you want to donate to a cool star organization then you can do it by pressing this button okay oh uh, yeah my phone just restarted again and I have now to complete the um, to complete the phase of um, of that activation so it restarted again let me put pause and I'll be back after I uh, activate it okay so uh, it's it's done it uh, completed the setup part I activated as normal and everything was erased but not the CDA okay so I'm still jailbroken as you can see I made two screenshots right now you can look at the date and here okay and as you can see it uh, rebooted to the normal uh, screen and this is the next uh, the next one as you can see the hour the hour here and the hour here okay it has Cydia even if it was um, restored okay and Cydia does open but I think Cydia will uh, start again that uh, process oh no it didn't I, I didn't lost anything from Cydia let me show that CDI is still um, usable. I made a screenshot right now. Hopefully it will get here as uh, accept. Made another one. Okay, go ahead. We're now uh, able to to kill that program. Okay, and let's wait for the latest screenshot. Okay, there we go. This is where uh, where CDR was loading, and that's it. CDR after uh, loading. So it's still uh, I'm still broken, and it works. Okay, so this is basically it. You can do the same for any device uh, from iOS 5.0 to iOS 8.4. The link is in the description and um, don't forget to come on the forum, uh, forum.fc365.info and talk about anything you want. Tweaks, Cydia, iCloud Bypass, activation, unlock for the SIM card and tweaks and multiple things. I think I say tweaks. Uh, oh no, I say tweaks two times. Oh god damn it. So this is it. Thank you guys. I'm Joe Snow and till the next time, have a great day.